One of New Zealand's wealthiest businessmen, Sir Ron Brierley, arrested at Sydney Airport and charged with possession of child pornography. Here's a summary of the article. One of New Zealand's wealthiest and most respected businessmen, Sir Ron Brierley, has reportedly been arrested at Sydney Airport and charged with possession of child pornography. The 82-year-old corporate raider, who founded R.A. Brierley Investments, New Zealand's largest listed company until the 1987 crash, has sat on numerous company boards in his home country, in Australia and the UK. When in Sydney, he resides in Australia's most expensive street, Point Piper's Wolseley Road. According to NSW police, detectives from Eastern Suburbs Police Area Command commenced an investigation into the possession of child abuse material in the local area in August. On Tuesday, an 82-year-old was stopped by Australian Border Force officers at Mascot Airport about 6.30 a.m. while trying to board a plane for Fiji, police said. The man's carry-on luggage was searched before the contents of his laptop and electronic storage devices were reviewed, which are alleged to have contained large amounts of child abuse material, the police statement said. The Point Piper man was taken to Mascot Police Station and charged with six counts of possessed child abuse material. Sir Ron was knighted in 1988 and as a former trustee of the Sydney Cricket and Sports Ground Trust, former president of New Zealand Cricket and former chairman of the Bank of New Zealand. He was granted strict conditional bail and will appear at Downing Centre Local Court on February 10. This post received a score of 36,650, with an upvote ratio of 97%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. One of New Zealand's wealthiest and most respected businessmen, Sir Ron Brierley, has reportedly been arrested at Sydney Airport and charged with possession of child pornography. The 82-year-old, who founded corporate rating company R.A. Brierley Investments in the 1960s and sits on numerous company boards in New Zealand, Australia and the UK, was stopped by Australian Border Force officers about 6.30 a.m. on Tuesday. Sir Ron was knighted in 1988 and as a former trustee of the Sydney Cricket and Sports Ground Trust and former president of New Zealand Cricket. Sad to hear he committed suicide in his jail cell next week. This isn't in America, New Zealand or Australia would probably have an actual investigation into something that's suspicious. He was granted conditional bail. Trial February. Billionaire. Likely access to private transportation, either planes or yachts. Non-extradition country ho. I can't find his net worth but an article in 2016 said he was estimated at $100 million NZD which is nowhere near a billionaire. Tilde $66 million United States dollars. Wait, seriously? I'm in Winnipeg and even our much maligned trash fashion magnate Peter Nygaard is worth several hundred million. I would hope this is just a case of the paper playing with hyperbole. Hiding riches is more common in old money people, new money likes to show it off, old money wants to keep it in the family forever. If Sir Ron has kitty porn it's a dead cert he knows others who do as well. Good work done by Border Patrol for rounding up the perverts. Soon we will be reading about how he also committed suicide in jail. Sucks that he's going to be suicided next week. Rip in advance. I'm not sure if Reddit has much steam left to generate another set of someone didn't kill themselves memes. Oh we do. I only give this guy a mooch or two before he hangs up his hat. While still wearing it. By the way Epstein didn't kill himself you guys. Can knighthood get revoked or something? Yep, stripped of the title and all that goes with it. What goes with it other than being able to walk around with your sword out? Sir. Yes? You're making a scene. What else do billionaires do in their spare time other than molest kids? Fuckers think they can abide by their own laws. Edit, any squillionaires want to weigh into this conversation? Probably too busy groping a child. Laws aside, like WTF. I feel like the rich have a much higher predisposition to being sexually attracted to children. Why? Selection bias. You don't hear about it when it's no one. European authorities busted a massive ring earlier this year and arrested over 600 people, it included no one you heard of and it never made it to Reddit. It's the same reason people think there's so much sexual harassment in Hollywood versus other industries. There was a bunch of sexual harassment at the Applebee's I used to work at as well but it didn't so much make the news. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. 
The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.